Hello guys and welcome back to another video. In today's video, I decided to um, expose Eric's car a little bit. Um, his car doesn't always look this bad, but I think this is the worst I've seen it. And while I'm in it, I guess I should clean the car for Eric since I'm going to be exposing him. Um, I don't think he knows what's going on. Now he's hearing about it for the first time, but his car is a mess. Um, they say that car guys always have their cars super clean and that is false. Eric has so many car parts in his car. I don't even think he knows what's in there. So we're going to go ahead and jump into showing you guys what I'm working with and hopefully I can kind of clean the car at least so it's presentable. to see what I'm working with um, actually Eric has never cleaned this car he bought the car maybe like seven or eight months ago and he has not cleaned it at all um, as you guys might know Eric has multiple cars so he kind of uses one car for like a few months and then he goes on to using the other car so he's never just focused on working on this car or cleaning it so it's gonna take me a while to clean out the car I'm hoping I can kind of clean it a lot um, but it's getting dark um, so I have I think two hours to work with so hopefully I'm able to clean out most of it the rest of this video is gonna probably be a montage of me taking everything out of the car he literally has an interior of a whole car inside of this car and this is a little G20 and if it, it fits a lot of stuff but I'm like come on like it's a, such a small car like you can't be putting all of that stuff in there but um, the seats are ripped on this one. That's why he has another interior. Um, if you guys don't follow him, he does make all of these uh, videos on his channel. If you guys are interested in following him for the car detail videos, that's the channel to be on. But I'm going to go ahead and start cleaning because I don't have too much time. But I do hope you guys are enjoying exposing Eric. <laughs> how it's turning out I know you guys can't really tell but it does look a lot better um, there is a lot of stains on the actual car so I'm gonna go ahead and try to see if I'm able to remove some of the stains on there the carpet is pretty dirty so honestly I'm not even gonna put the mats in there because the mats itself was pretty disgusting but that's how it's turning out I'm gonna try to clean out the doors and we'll see how much more I can get cleaned this is where I'm going to be focusing on. Um, it's pretty dirty back here, so I'm gonna do both of the back seats, this and the seats. I'm going to be using some carpet cleaner. This is for like interior house cleaning. So we'll see if we're able to lift up that stain a little bit. Um, I think what it was, it was that they had cats living in this car because there is a lot of cat hair all over the car. But I'm gonna go ahead and see if I'm able to lift all of these. I'm going to be using this, um, you can buy this at the dollar store. Um, it's really good for cleaning. I don't even know if I'm allowed to use it on cars, but we're gonna try it out. Hopefully it doesn't lift up the color, but let's try it. dark now but this is everything that was inside of Eric's car that I was able to get out like I mentioned I'm definitely gonna just throw these out because they're pretty disgusting um, the inside is still not done I have not had chance to really work on the front of the car I've only been working on the back but the back is done I still need to clean these doors I was able to get um, all the cat hair off the dash with some lens roller which definitely helped but I'm trying to get these stains out of the seats. Hopefully I'm able to get some of it off. But I'm going to go ahead and show you guys um, the end of the video probably next week once we have better light and once I'm able to get the car into the car wash. But for the most part, this is where I'm going to be leaving it off for tonight. It's been a few days since the last time that I cleaned the car and Eric has struck again. He has bought more car parts and placed them in the car. 
if you guys remember last week it took me a while to be able to get everything out and he actually has more things in the trunk so what we're gonna do is take everything out and start cleaning it once again I'm pretty much almost done however I did want to go ahead and start cleaning the inside console um, I know that the seats are pretty bad there is really not much I can do about them but Eric does have replacements for them I just don't know when he'll replace it so I'm gonna go ahead and move on to the dash get this all cleaned out um, the carpet's still pretty dirty but we did vacuum that and most of the cat hair is gone so I'm gonna go ahead and move on to cleaning that and then I'm gonna move on to cleaning the trim of the car it's pretty dirty like I mentioned Eric has not cleaned this car ever since he's had it and it's been like seven months so Let's get to cleaning. This is gonna be the end of today's video. Um, I tried cleaning the car as much as I possibly could. Um, there's just a lot of things that I obviously couldn't do, like the stains on the seats. Um, unless I had like an actual good uh, vacuum, I don't think I can take it out. But I definitely think it looks a lot better than before. I'm going to be the judge of how bad Eric had this car. But like I said, he never cleaned it. He bought it like that and that's how he drove it. So he never cleaned it. There was so much cat hair in this car. I honestly had to shower right after um, I cleaned it because I felt disgusting. But I do hope you guys enjoyed this video of me exposing eric's vehicle because it was kind of disgusting if i'm being honest but if you guys did like the video please don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys all in my next video